Yes, people, yes, people. Beautiful morning, beautiful sunshine, and the Almighty sent the way to cool the heat. So you must first give thanks for that. Yes, give thanks to all the people that are here today. Those that are consistent, those that are new here. We are going through rough times, tough times, even though some people might not show it because some people just got the pride. But a lot of people out here in Barbados, they are struggling. They are finding it hard. Even a lot of people lost their jobs. A lot of people ain't know how to get something to eat nor drink. You have people that have to share rooms, share rent, share everything. They have people that for the morning gotta get up and go for the, the side road, side the road, yes, big up, and ask people for their dollar. You got some people that are going to beg, they beg in the government, the, the politicians, but I can't find them. But I want to know, we have been tricked. We have been tricked along the way. And the more that we try to keep we head above water, they try to put harder burdens on me. Why should you wait to 68 to get a pension? Why they are making at 50 and get it all there? Nice life, nice life and living their big life and travel off of the hard earned money. All of us are taxpayers and we gonna stand up for our rights. If you give in to this, to this bill, the next thing can carry it up. Sabbath Next thing, cause remember, she did so one thing, and next thing she moved this change, she moved this twist. More than a school face woman. Imagine, a, the USA say they don't want, yes, they don't want the jobs that ain't good for them people. And a, a leader can take them and give it to the people. Wait, no damn, if it ain't good for them, it ain't, it good for we too. But that's a total insult that the, to the people of Barbados. And I want you people to wait and aware. And all you see in every day is people just passing out, suffering from this and suffering from that. A lot of these people can make it a 68 so they can get to save all this money. People, some people might make it, some people might not. So people, you must be aware of what's going on in Barbados. Be aware. Don't take that party in. We're not party in and enjoy everything. I feel like everything's here from Grandy. But let me tell you, night and day is two different things. Remember that. When the night done, the sun can come up with the fire. So I'll be prepared to face the heat. I hope that we're not prepared. Because we're not letting these people do too much things too wrong to win us. And when they coming out and supporting. All it takes is all when I come out and make the numbers more. And let the people see that, yes. Be serious about our country. Be serious about our rights. And be serious about justice. Pull back the bill. Pull back the bill. Pull back the bill. But the power the most high, that bill must be pulled back. You can't treat your people this way. Know what is right and know what is wrong. Know what is evil and know what is wicked and know what is good. I don't know what is bad. People, we are going through rough times and you can't just be a put one or two harder times by passing this bill. Because you, these youths know that coming up now, that if they work for 5,000 a month, they can going to be getting about $100 in pension. And look, look where the stage we are. $100 could do what they right now. So you know by that time then, $100 can go in by a, a, probably a loaf of bread. Because we are how the world is swinging now, Ain't nothing coming down, everything going up. For example, the small things are going up, up but I see things not come down. Open one of mine. You treat the youths of the day, think that everything brandy and sweet because when I get a chance to come back out and run to a party and eat and drink, the, the way they go with the store, because no way when they drink the alcohol, when the mental faculties is not going to function that 100%, and when I'm going to dismiss all these issues that, gonna, that is very important to you all in your life and there will watch you drunk and go to the grave before you reach 68 this bill must be pulled back a lot of people they want you to pay okay it was 500 contributions no they want you to 
to be a summer hundred and fifty contributions. Imagine two hundred and fifty more contributions. People have been weary for COVID. Hard times. Yes, some of them get get laid off. Some of them and they lost the job. And uh, they didn't know what to do. And they depend upon that little pension. Are you making it hard for these people to reach to that pension? This is wickedness going on in this country. Instead, you should be bringing it down. Not Canada. If you are, you say that you care about your people. When you care about someone, you make sacrifices for the people. Now tell me, is that a sacrifice? That is a burden. So we don't want more burdens. We want sacrifice. The, the politician, if they have to 68, we want without 60 then. If we now 50, I'm gonna carry you at 68. We wanna go go 60 or 68 like we do. Because when they, we the laborers that be sweating their heart in the sun, some of us maybe get home and got time for buying me children. Well, we're going to the office, some of them don't even got nothing much to do. And then when they really did then, when I got reap a big set of money, and the poor people still up there working hard, go work. Uh, 18 more years to get some little feedback, some little get change from the government at the pension. What? Nah, we ain't standing for that. They ain't gonna pull back this bill. But the power and the most high, they ain't gonna pull back this bill. Pull back the bill. We got morals, we got integrity, and we want accountability. And so far, this government is showing it. They are not showing it. They are, they, are, they are showing tricks and deceitful. They are only, they are only here with the friends and the family. Make sure that they're good. While we, the real, the real, real people that need, ain't getting what we're supposed to get. So my brothers and sisters, stand firm. I'm Bangalore.